dear students are you aiming for top colleges of karnataka like rv bms pes where the placements are at par with iits and nits or have you realized that the exam of je is very near and your preparation is not up to the level but still you are aiming for a very good college where you can secure your future then this video is for you yes in this video we are going to talk about one very important exam which serve all the above purposes in through this exam you can enter into the top colleges of karnataka competition is less here and also you can get into the best branches and best placements so yes we are talking about the exam comet k 2026 now please watch this complete video if you are an aspirant of 2026 comet k examination or you have no information about this video this video will tell you all the details about this particular exam and i also have something very very important i can say exciting news for all of you also okay so let's get started here first of all what all things we have uh, in this lecture let's see so first of all why comet k why you should plan or why should you prepare for comet k examination second what are the important dates when the forms are released when the exams are conducted so that you have an idea how much time exactly you have for preparation next the eligibility criteria of this particular examination exam pattern and syllabus very very important is it similar to your je neat uh, kct or is it having something very different lastly we'll be talking about the top colleges and the cut off and place placement so that you can have a clear idea about uh what exactly you will be getting if you get into these colleges so let's get started here with the first one why comet k is a great option the first thing is it has a wide range of colleges over 200 plus engineering colleges in karnataka accept the comet k marks and they give you admissions and the second thing is high quality education so you need you don't have to worry about your future at all these colleges have top notch faculties infrastructure industry experience everything is there here next less competitive than jwe this is the most important thing you know around uh, like 14 lakhs 13 lakhs students write the exam of jwe and very few i can say like a uh, very very few people or very few students from that get into iits and nits whereas in comet k 1 lakh to 2 lakh students right the number has increased slightly from last year but yes this is also very less competition here because of uh, uh, less awareness about this examination so yes definitely here you can have an edge in your preparation and you can definitely crack this examination if you slightly strategize your preparation and slightly modify your preparation next we have good package yes as i told you in the introduction only this colleges that you can get through comet k have par packages as compared to iits and nits moving text we have here top institutes that are preparing so there are almost 200 plus institutes but this list i have just given you an example so you have very good colleges like rv pes uh, uh, then you have uh, sorry rv colleges there bms colleges there uh, then you have uh, dhanan sagar colleges there so these are all top 20 colleges which can take admission through comet k okay moving forward here yes now i told you that i'll give you something very very interesting news here so we have our kc90 online crash course on your demand that has that will be launched very soon on your demand for the preparation of kct and comet k examination so many of you have told us to start an online course because you are staying in different parts of the country you it will be difficult for you to uh, take the offline course so that is why kc90 online course it is an exam for both preparation of kct and comet k in 90 days you got the name kct plus comet k in 90 days here you will be getting entire syllabus coverage uh, mock test part test full length test everything will be covered in detail so yes that is there now there will be many of the students who are not eligible for kct because for kct you need to have some origin with karnataka some restrictions are there so if you just want to prepare for comet k only comet k then also you have option for here you can see we have only comet k online crash course also so that is also a 
available you can check that okay so link of this all uh, things will be available in our description section you can click there and buy our products so just let me tell you this the comet k90 online crash course only comet k will be available at 599 okay so this is remember this is just the uh, the early birds discounted offer that we are giving you and this is a 90 day crash course everything will be comp uh, like compiled and covered so you don't have to go for any other resource if you have taken this one crash course this 5999 or roughly 6000 right, that you have invested here will assure that you are getting your dream college you just have to uh, take this course and just follow our instructions that's all you have to do now if you are planning to take both of them for KCT plus Comet K if you're planning for both at that then we have a price of 999 for both the courses okay so the individual courses are 6000 6000 so it's almost 12000 but if you take together you will get a discount and you will get it at 999 okay so that is the course and the details of these all things are there in the description section please go there and click and then you will understand what all things we are providing now moving forward here the important dates that you should remember so these are all dates for 2025 comet k examination and similar timeline will be followed for 2026 examination also so first one is on 3rd of february the application will start on 15th of march the application will close then on 4th uh, sorry 11th april you will have some time to edit your application so these all process will be there the exam date was this year on 10th of May 2025 this is important so you have enough time now if you start preparing from now onwards you can still crack Comet K because you will be having in the month of May and if you start from now you can easily complete the syllabus and if you take our crash course that will definitely be done by December and then we will give you full revision practice mock test everything okay Moving forward, eligibility criteria, this is very important, you should know whether you are eligible for this or not. Okay, so yeah, let me just see the eligibility here. So all the citizens of India are eligible for this exam. There is no state uh, restriction, Wh whichever state you belong, if you are citizen of India, you are eligible. Now there are certain academic eligibility criteria also. So you should be having the qualifying examinations prescribed for the admission of BTEC is second PUC or 10 plus 2 higher, uh, 10 plus 2 secondary or equivalent uh, examination recognized by state and central. Okay. So you basically you should have completed your 12th and what are the subjects that you should have physics chemistry okay you should have physics chemistry maths with english as a compulsory subject physics chemistry maths and english okay next we have uh, the general merit candidates should have passed with a minimum aggregate of 45 percent okay you should have a minimum percentage of 45 percent and 40 percent in respect to the obc and sc st candidates of karnataka state okay so this reservation is only for the karnataka students for all other students they will be considered as general merit and you need to have an aggregate of 45 percent now uh, physics uh, so there are some important things here also so and you should have passed physics, chemistry and math subject individually. Okay. Physics and mathematics are compuls compulsory subject along with chemistry or biotechnology or biology, computer science, electronics as one of the optional subject. However, changes if any in the eligibility criteria by the AICT or VTU will be ad adopted. So basically you should have physics, chemistry and physics, maths and any of these subjects will be there. But your aggregate percentage in physics, chemistry and math should be 45% please remember this one very very important next uh, diploma candidates are not eligible so please be very careful diploma candidates after 10th those who have done diploma you are not eligible for comet k examination okay now coming to the syllabus the syllabus is very simple it is the cbsc syllabus of class 11th and 12th and from 11th standard 33 percent of the questions will be asked and from 12th uh, 67 percent questions will be asked okay moving forward to the exam pattern this is very important so you will have 66 
60 60 questions from physics chemistry and maths which accounts for 180 questions okay 180 questions 180 marks because each question carries one mark and there is no negative marking this is the best part of this exam and you will be allotted a time of three hours so this exam will be conducted in three slots different uh, student will be allotted different slots so 8 30 to 11 30 to 1 pm to 4 pm 5 30 to 8 30 pm so this will be different slots in which that will be according to your admit card you will get to know and you have to write the exam so total there is 180 questions 180 marks three hours time and no negative marking okay so and medium of the english will be a medium will be english only and the exam type is mcq based exam okay moving for and the best part one more best part here is which is very unique is in this exam you are given with calculator okay so there is an inbuilt calculator in your so this is a computer based exam it is not pen and paper so this is online exam okay and there is in the interface you will have calculator also will be given so that you can even do your calculations easily okay moving forward here to the uh, exam pattern i already discussed some top colleges and the cutoff so these are some top colleges you can see for rv college the cutoff was 531 for computer science bms 1319 msrit 1358 so these are some top colleges and their cutoff so you can just check this so that you can have an idea how much you need to get the rank to get into top colleges so students that was all about this particular uh, uh, exam that is called Comet K and let me tell you this is going to be a very very good alternative for those students who are who were preparing for JEE and somehow you might feel that you will not be able to crack the examination this will give you the same results but with less competition here there are more chances of getting selected and you will be ending up with the best colleges in Karnataka so and yes we are also providing you assistance to prepare for this examination many of you might not be aware so you don't have to take any tension you just need to uh, go to the description section you can check our products and the best thing is we are expertise we are having this expertise in providing or producing results in this examination last year also we have created toppers here so do check this out and definitely consider this this is going to be something which can really really boost your preparation right so thank you so much all the best and do let me know in the comment section are you interested for this exam